The day's workshop was to empower media practitioners in Sunyani on key policies guiding Ghana's insurance sector. Currently, about 44% of Ghana's working population, former and informal, is on one insurance policy or the other. Ghana comes second after South Africa on the African continent in terms of insurance coverage. Dr. Justice Yawufuri speaking at the workshop disclosed that another five-year strategic plan will be rolled out by the end of the year to help increase insurance coverage from the current 44 percent. We have a strategic plan um, when we took office to actually help with the, uh, uh, with the insurance penetration. A, a five year strategic plan. It's ending this year. So after this year, we'll, before the end of the year, we'll come up with another strategic plan. Now, that five year strategic plan took into account some of the things we are doing right now. Because gone are the days when there was no commissioner visiting, we didn't have branch offices. Because if you want our presence to be felt, it means that we have to put people on the ground. So we started with having um, uh, expanding. Our, 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 our network to the old 10 regions. We also embarked on public education, um, just like we are doing right now. We also provided, actually we've trained 10,000 insurance agents. The program, uh, we did it through the Ghana Insurance College, all nationwide. Uh, all these things, we believe that as people are uh, appreciating insurance, it will encourage them to explain it to their family and then also uh, uh, buy more insurance. We've also, we've also come up with a, a new insurance act that came in last year and in which we have some insurances which are compulsory, like marine and fire, we've, we've tightened them, uh, so that we have some insurance that will actually shoot up uh, the, the penetration. Dr. Furi admonished Ghanaians to embrace insurance because it is a surest way to secure their future. He also called on prospective Ghanaians who want to enroll onto various insurance policies to do a background checks before they start set policies. Uh, the idea behind insurance is to actually provide some kind of protection. Uh, as human beings, we have risk all over us. Even from our offices or our homes to this place, we went through some risk. Sleeping at night, you go through some risk before you wake up. Even your own health, there's a risk. People sleep, they get heart attack. People sleep, they die. All these things need some kind of protection, and that is why insurance comes in. You have a house, it catches fire. So everything that we do in our lives, risk is part of it. The vehicle in which you sat in before you got here, you went through some risk. We regulate a lot of companies, and I'm not saying that everybody is good and everybody is bad, but I'm sure you get some referrals. I want to go to company A. What is their claims record? I mean, ask somebody. You get me? You do your due diligence. But my advice to you is that always don't go for the cheapest. You have car insurance. As we said, the minimum uh, premium is uh, 327. And you go and somebody tells you, I'll give you premium, I'll give you insurance for 200 cities. And you believe the guy, you'll be getting counterfeit. For City Business News, I am Michael Saponifum, Sunyane.